I'm Catherine from Transforming the Trent Valley and Stasha Wallace Trust, supported by the National Lottery Heritage Fund. Today I am making a butterfly feeder. Here is all the equipment you will need. PVA glue, scissors, tape, sugar water, stick, a pencil, um, bottle cap and card. The first thing we're going to do is draw a flower for the top of our feeder. So I'm using the bottle cap as a template for the centre of the flower. And then I'm just drawing some petals to go round. As you can see, I've decided to go with a daisy for the flower. But if you'd like to do a different type of flower, you can. Um, if you want to design your own flower, it'd be great to see what creations you make. I'm just going to cut the flower out now. I've kept mine quite simple, but if you've got different coloured pens and pencils at home that you want to decorate your flower, that'll be great. You can use bright colours to attract the butterflies. So I'm just cutting around each petal out the, to get the flower out of the card. Um, I've used card because it's a bit sturdier than paper. If you don't have card at home, you can always use a couple of sheets of paper stuck together just so that you have that strength behind the flower. Once I finish cutting out the flower, I will need a stem. So I recommend going to your garden or local area just to find a nice stick to attach to the flower. Here's one I've collected early and I'm just going to attach it with two strips of tape. Just to make sure it's secure. Now I'm going to attach the bottle cap to the center of the flower using PVA glue just on the back. You can always cut out the flower, attach the bottle cap with PVA glue, allow it to dry and then add the stick, but that's up to you. Here is my sugar water solution. I've put a teaspoon of sugar in and then filled my jar that I'm using up to the top with water and then mixed it. Because the flower will be stood up, I'm gonna use a cotton bud and we're gonna soak it with sugar water and place it in the middle. If you don't want to use a cotton bud, you could always just use the sugar water in the bottle cap, but you just need to make sure that it is lying flat, otherwise all the water will come out. The cotton bud may get dry after a while, so you just have to re-soak it with the sugar water. To make it look like a proper flower, I have put it in a pot with soil and stood it up. I've also put the flower at a bit of an angle, just so the cotton bud won't fall out. But now you just have to sit back and see how many butterflies come to your feeder. Thank you for watching and please share your creations with us.